Well, it's a beautiful summer's day, and we're gonna do something that I really don't like doing myself, so I brought someone in to do it. But before we start, make sure you subscribe. Amanda, how are you? I'm fantastic, how are you? <laughs> good, it's good to see you again. <laughs> it's great to see you okay. guys. I can't wait to see what you're gonna to do to this thing because I heard you're gonna clean these rims like they've never been cleaned before. I brought you a great product today. All right, what'd you it's bring? It's a product by Sonax. It's a Sonax wheel cleaner. Um, you can visit their website at sonaxcanada.com for a list of dealers. What it does is we're just gonna go in with it. We're gonna spray the entire rim. You don't need to do anything to the rim beforehand. Um, this is completely dry. Ideally, you would wanna do it in the shade, um, okay. but we're just having a hard time with that today. So yeah. we're gonna cheat a little and do it in the sunlight, but it's actually not too hot. If you feel the rim, it's actually pretty cool. Yeah, it's not so bad. So we should okay. be all right. So we're gonna go in. It's gonna come out of the bottle a greenish color. What I want you to watch for is it's going to change red as it comes in contact with the brake dust and all the dirt and grime. And it's actually going to change that brake dust into a reddish color without harming the finish of the wheel. And you can use this on aluminum wheels or whatever you want. This is safe on all surfaces. Okay. So your chrome wheels, your alloys, plastic, coated, painted, it can be safe on anything. Don't worry about it if you spray and get it onto rim or your rotor or brake sections. That's fine. It's going to rinse off and it's not going to harm anything. Okay, great. Well, we'll so, give it a few minutes, I guess. We're going to give it about three to five minutes, but if we just wait, it really starts to react very quickly. As you can see, some of yep. the, it's actually some of the rust is actually turning red. Um, these lug nuts, however, do have a little bit of rust on it. It's not going to take the rust away, but what we're more concerned about is, is brake dust. Yeah, absolutely. And, so check out the wheel that we finished. If you actually just run your hand along that, there's almost next to nothing. I mean, there's going to still be a little bit. Oh yeah. But you can just see, all we did was really rinse that with the hose. We did a little mild agitation with the wheel brush, not much. There's still gonna need to be polished after, but that was a real time saver. So let's move over to the front because sure. we've moved on to the second wheel and we've let that sit for about three or five minutes. Oh yeah. And you can see, completely turned all red. So step back a little I'm bit, I'm way, gonna rinse me. it all off. And again, not using a crazy amount of pressure. And you can really just see how it really just takes that away very easily. Also note too that it does not stain your driveway. It's not going to hurt your uh, concrete or asphalt surface. It's not going to dye your driveway red or anything like that. You're pretty much done rinsing. I think we'll go back in with the wheel brush and some fresh water and just give a little agitation, just to really loosen up anything that may still be on there and crevices in the wheels and that's great and such. But I mean, again, I'm using just a very gentle hand with the wheel brush. I'm not scrubbing very hard. It's no. very effortless. So yeah, it really works. Yeah, there you have it. Yeah, an absolutely incredible product, and you can see that hasn't been polished or anything, the front wheel and no marks or anything. And again, you can run your hand along there. It's very, very clean for what it is. So yeah, highly cool. recommend this product. It's one of my favorites. It's not bad. So remember to click and subscribe so you can know your ride and drive. Thanks for watching.